So if you learn how to self-reflect, uh, you can see the progress uh, easier. Uh, yeah, you can see the progress easier. And then when you see the re results, you are happier with yourself and it motivates you to learn some more. What do you think? I think it's a very difficult process to self-assess mm -hmm. yourself, of course. Uh, maybe it's easier for us, for us, for the student to see what they are good at, mm -hmm. but I think it might be very difficult to say, oh, I have this, I'm struggling here. Um, I think it's very important for the student to self-assess mm -hmm. uh, and to think uh, about his progress in the course. So uh, they need to learn how to do so, how to how to do it. Maybe first it's a little bit fake, you know, yeah. they, they will probably write down some uh, you know, for forced answers and over time they will learn how to self-reflect better yeah. and be because, more true with themselves. Because it's for, yes, they, that's it, they have to be truthful and true to themselves because nobody's evaluating them. Yeah, but even them. if it doesn't come naturally at first, uh, mm -hmm. they should learn how to do so, you know, yeah. over time. Yeah, that's it. They have to learn and we have to teach them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It takes time. <laughs>